Okay guys, question time. How many of you think that you have any control over getting to your next belt level in Jiu Jitsu? If you think you do, uh, give me a thumbs up on this video. If you don't, share with me below why you think you don't. So where do we start first? Number one, ask your instructor your goal level. So if you're a white belt going to blue, if you ultimately want to know what it takes to get to black belt, have that dialogue with your instructor. You know, that you're gonna to get to know certain things about your instructor that they value more than other things. And that's an important discussion to have. Does your school have values around uh, attendance and showing up and being a good teammate? Or are they more competition focused? Do medals matter to them? Do competition wins matter to them? very important for you to know that because if your goals don't match what their values are your ability to get to that next level may may frankly just be mismatched and you may might need to look for another school or another academy that matches more closely with what your goals are in your jiu-jitsu journey when you ask that question it's not an entitlement question either so making it very clear you're goal oriented, you're setting goals, and you wanna know what it's gonna to take to achieve the next level of growth in Jiu Jitsu. Many different training academies do not have measurement systems for growth. It's arbitrary and it's left up to the instructor's discretion. Maybe the instructors over time have a black belt panel that they ask uh, vo or vote on to see if they think students are ready to progress. Other academies, I'll use Gracie Jiu Jitsu and Gracie University as an example, their curriculum is very structured. They have specific techniques you need to demonstrate in a very specific way before you'll even get to the next belt level.